There is another Fiona Hislop, and it's a myth in reality. The other Fiona Hislop is a mod winning Harsbach player. <laughs> and people used to always say to me, says, Fiona, I didn't realise you were so talented. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm very pleased to be here at the launch of the 2014 uh, Scottish International Storytelling Festival. It's very fitting that it takes place during this month. Uh, the nights are starting to draw in. We begin to metaphorically gather closer to the hearth, and there's no better time to celebrate the old traditions and the living magic of storytelling. Um, I'm delighted at this time um, that we can also recognise all the different parts of uh, our storytelling celebrations and the new and the cutting edge of our art forms and also to highlight the storytelling. Uh, perhaps the oldest form of our culture is in such root and vibrant health and I think we should celebrate that as well. Kirsty answered the phone and it was a neighbour from just up the road wanting a book back that Kirsty had borrowed and she wanted it back right away. And Kirsty looked at the baby lying in the cradle. It was fast asleep and she thought, Ach, it's just a mile up the road, it'll just take ten minutes, I'll just go and do that. So she jumped in the car, headed off to the neighbours. The neighbour was a very chatty woman and she kept Kirsty there for much longer than she wanted to be, with as much local gossip as she could stand, and eventually she managed to tear herself away and got back into the car and headed home. Now, Kirsty's favourite album, it just so happens, was an album that Rachel made called The Shadow Side, which is all about <laughs> the supernatural, songs about supernatural goings on. In fact, she might even have a couple of copies in her <laughs> <laughs> case for you. And maybe it was an idea put in her head by the songs, or maybe it was something that the neighbour had said, or maybe it was just her own imagination. But she had to step on the brakes when she saw a procession of figures very briefly crossing the road in front of her. And even the hint of a white horse. 
Nah, she thought. Couldn't be. Must just be a trick of the light. Just my imagination. And then she thought, oh my god, the fairy folk. And I've left the baby on its own in the house. <laughs>